I wonder what it's like being a chemist and a Christian. Let's see if Jonathan can tell us. The more I study science, uh, the more complex and intricate and surprising the, the universe turns out to be. Um, but for me, that, that reinforces my sense of wonder in uh, God as creator. The more the universe seems to fit together uh, and, and uh, follow laws and rules and, and that there is a, a, a coherence behind it, um, the more it makes sense to me that, that there must be a creator and that, that, um, uh, that a, a rule maker, a lawmaker um, uh, that, that is behind that. What different questions can you answer through studying chemistry or other sciences? Yeah. So science is a way of making sense of the world, and it's very good at explaining all sorts of uh, different natural phenomena. So if you've got a, a question such as, um, why is the sky blue, or how old is the universe? Science is very good at bringing together different bits of information and putting them together in a way that can, can explain those sorts of things. But there's also lots of questions that science just can't answer. Science describes the universe as we find it, but it doesn't explain why it's that way in the first place. And science can't tell us why we should do things. It can only tell us how things are. Um, and for all those sort of big questions, we need other tools for answering them because science just can't say anything about them. And so for me, Christianity is a, a great way of understanding how to answer some of those other questions. So how should I live my life? You know, what is the meaning and purpose of the universe? And these aren't scientific questions. Science can't provide answers for them, but Christianity can. And so for me, uh, the more I learn about Christianity, uh, I certainly don't have answers to all of those questions, um, but it helps me uh, answer those questions and live out my life in, in a way uh, that I want to live. That's amazing, Jonathan. Thanks. Bye.